The first port of call was the China Cultural Center Abuja, where the students were conducted round the center and were taught the 40 years of China's developmental journey, exposing them to cultural, political, and technological history of the country. It's used for the Beijing Olympic. You can see the member of the stadium here. This is black, right? Yes. And this one is the rising. These are actually called Chinese lanterns. The students also took learning to the Revenue Mobilization and Fiscal Commission, where directors took turns to lecture the students on the functions of the commission, treating topics on tax reforms, tax invasion, corruption, and more. The delegation leader, Professor Magnus Madu, and others say Ibnitium University Okada, IUO, is premised on cross fertilization of ideas entrepreneurial leadership and hands-on training to prepare the student for the dynamics of the society. To sensitize the students of international relations and diplomacy to what is happening in outside Nigeria. Things about the reformation of China, how China has actually succeeded in becoming the, one of the world powers. It is, believe me, important that you know what revenue mobilization does. The student described the excursion as one of its kind. The Chinese took 40 years to transform their economic and they have um, different religions so that we have the Buddhist. This excursion to the China's Cultural Center is mostly exposing us to the culture and the languages and experiences of in China. The discussion continues Thursday, 11th July. Organic Victor, ITV News.